Hi ladies, Sarah here with Faithful Finish Lines. Good to be with you today. Every Friday we answer a reader question about weight loss or healthy eating or fitness. And a reader wrote in and asked me and Becky, how can I, how can I stay with my program? Like I'll lose weight and then I gain it back or I'll do really well with healthy eating for a while and then I just tend to fall off the rails. So today I want to I want to answer that question and talk to you a little bit about what to do when you get derailed or you might say fall off the wagon or I'm not on program or however the wording works for you but I think we all can relate to I'm doing really well and then I just kind of blow it. <laughs> so a few different thoughts that I have First of all, the more that you can move away from the black and white thinking of I'm on or I'm off, that will help you so much because, and I did this for years, I was a compulsive eater, I was a binge eater, and when you look at that binge eating cycle, this is exactly what I would do. The more you have that black and white thinking of I'm on or I'm off, your eating is going to look like this. I'm up and I'm down, I'm on and I'm off. And what we want to do is have a little bit more steady... Um, way things are going for you. So, you know, now that I've been maintaining my weight loss for a long time, I'm more steady. You know, I have times where I might eat, overeat a little bit, but then it comes back down and then maybe I'm able to really, you know, keep things super healthy for a few days. But generally the pattern of how I'm eating looks like this. So there's some still ups and downs and same with my exercise, times when I'm exercising more or less, but it's generally steady. Whereas when I was binging, it looked like this. <laughs> <laughs> up and down and um, if you're stuck in this up and down pattern and you want to get out of it um, a couple of different thoughts but the main one for me is to recognize that you're not going to move from this to this right away it's going to take some time so you need to be okay with okay if I used to be like this now I'm gonna be like this and that's good that's progress that's wonderful progress and eventually I can move to this so having some compassion for yourself some acceptance some grace is really helpful because the more you beat yourself up the more you um, are just overloaded with guilt the more you put yourself down that's gonna keep you in this cycle of up and down because when you have that guilt then you think oh I've got to restrict I've got to get super strict and that's just not um, it's not beneficial because it keeps you in that pattern. So I would love for you to start thinking of just bringing it down a little bit with the highs not being so high, the lows not being so low, but aiming for a little bit more consistency and giving yourself grace. Give yourself grace that you are working on this. You are trying and there's something to be said for that and that God is right there with you. He wants to help you as you struggle with some of these things he is there to help you as you struggle and what's absolutely amazing is that we have the holy spirit inside of us you have the holy spirit inside of you and he has all the power that you'll absolutely ever need to overcome these problems so I spend time praying and I want you to know that Becky and I are praying for you, but to pray about these issues and talk to God and rely on his strength to make lasting changes. Um, a couple of uh, just quick tips. Um, when I have had a day when I've just really gone off and eaten tons of junk food, the next day I try to drink lots of water because probably you've taken in a lot of extra salt, so you're gonna see some weight gain, you're gonna feel kind of bloated, not feel as good. Having some extra water will help flush that out. And then I focus on tons of produce, lots of healthy vegetables. That's going to help um, kind of, that's the body's natural way of cleansing itself. You don't have to do any weird cleanses or anything like that. But eating vegetables does that for you naturally. And the other thing that that is helpful for is when you're eating lots of healthy foods, vegetables and fruits, you're not restricting. You're not saying, okay, I can't have any sugar. I can't have any junk food. I can't have this. I can't do this because then our mind starts to rebel, but instead keep it to, I can do this. I can have this and focus on those healthy foods that you enjoy. So here at Faithful Finish Lines, we help you with all of that. And I wanted to take a few minutes to tell you just a little bit more about our program. With this Healthy Holiday Challenge, we've had tons of new women come in and join us in this group. And I'm so excited that all of you are here. But I realize that some of you might not know anything about what Faithful Finish Lines is all about. 
So let me tell you a little bit about it. First of all, Faithful Finish Lines is run by me and by Becky, and each of us have lost over 100 pounds and have been keeping it off for years. So I put our 100 pound weight loss stories in the Facebook group. I'd love for you to go and check them out and I can put another link below too. I want you to understand that um, we are leading you because God has just made these amazing changes in our lives. We don't take any credit. We're not any different from you. It all has to do with the Holy Spirit working inside of us. So if we can do it, you can do it too. So what we've done is we have put together a program. It's all online and it's all for women and it's all faith-based. And we have a number of courses and um, products and things like that that we have available. And we also always have things for free. We will always and forever have our websites with tons of information that's free. This Facebook group is free. We do emails and challenges like this healthy holiday challenge. We have a number of different things that will always be free and available to you. But for the women who do want something extra, we have um, a number of courses that you can invest in. And our favorite is our seven weeks to Christian weight loss, healthy eating and fitness. That is our signature course that is available to you year round, 24 seven. Uh, you can purchase that today and have it available to you. But along with that, four times per year, we offer what's called premium support. And with that, we come in and together with this small group, we walk you step by step through the seven week program with our support. So we're there right beside you giving you VIP support. You get emails throughout the course. We have this super active Facebook group that you can be a part of. Um, you know, you're getting that one on one. If you have questions or comments or concerns, we're available to you for, um, for that support. And it's pretty unusual to meet two people who have lost 100 pounds and kept it off. So, but we're both doing it. So the fact that you get that access to us who have walk the walk, we are walking the walk, talk the talk, is just really something special. So premium support is closed right now, but you can get on the email list, but it's going to be opening very soon. So the next session that we'll be doing is January 7th. We limit the number of women who are in the program so that we can give you that, um, that attention. And last time we did a session, which was in the fall, it sold out. So we're expecting that this next one will sell out too. And the registration will be available for that starting on New Year's Day on January 1st. So you'll definitely want to get on the email, um, the waiting list, the email waiting list, and really think and pray. We encourage you to pray about it if this is the right decision for you. So I'm Sarah with Faithful Finish Lines. There are some helpful suggestions for you. If you go off the rails, we're here with grace and compassion and ready to help you get back on. Have a great afternoon. Bye-bye.